unlock the hidden power of your emotions and tap into a world of intuitive wisdom and psychic insights you never knew existed. Are you ready to dive deep into the sensual waters of the sacral chakra and discover how it can transform your ability to sense and understand the energies around you? I'm Christelle Arcucci, and I'm on a mission to change your experience with your body, pleasure, and power. Learn more about my work at EmbodySoulPurpose.com. You're listening to the Desire Sessions podcast, the lightning path to discover your desires and clear what's blocking you from receiving. Asking for what you want and receiving unapologetically is a revolutionary act. It's time to be the one you're looking for. This healing and hypnotic audio journey is designed to support you to restore your nervous system and enjoy personal power. It's ideal that you're listening in a place you can relax and receive. I'm very excited about the eight-week series in collaboration with the Sedona Soul Sisters show called the Ecstatic Empath Series. Many empaths are unknowingly attuned only to the pain body. This series will support you to have clear boundaries with pain and awaken the channels that fuel the bliss body with joy, ease, and grace. If you'd like to receive all of the resources and updates on the entire free Ecstatic Empath series, visit ecstaticempath.com and enter your name and email. Now close your eyes and place your hands on your lower belly below your navel. Feel the warmth of your hands connecting with your sacral chakra. Envision the creative intelligence. Feel the warmth of your hands connecting with your sacral chakra and the creative energy and emotional intelligence that is pulsing there. With each breath affirm, I open myself to the flow of intuition, embracing my ability to sense and understand emotions with clarity, courage, and compassion. The sacral chakra, below the navel and above the pubic bone, is our energetic center of emotion and intuition. It holds the key to unlocking profound emotional awareness and psychic sensitivity. Located in the lower abdomen, below the navel and above the pubic bone, this powerful energy vortex governs our ability to feel, connect, and interpret the subtle emotional currents that surround us. It plays a crucial role in developing emotional clairsentience, the psychic ability to sense and understand the feelings of others and the emotional imprints of places and objects. By nurturing and balancing the sacral chakra, we open ourselves to a deeper level of emotional intelligence, allowing us to navigate the complex landscape of human emotions with greater ease and insight. This chakra's connection to the water element enhances our capacity to flow with and intuitively understand emotional energies and charges, making it an essential focal point for those seeking to develop psychic and empathic abilities. The shadows and challenges of a sacral chakra that is out of balance, emotional repression, guilt, and shame. Guilt being the feeling of having done something wrong. Shame being the feeling that one is wrong or broken or something is wrong with the person. Addiction and excess, emotional codependency, creative blocks, sexual issues, lack of boundaries, fear of change, emotional volatility, and self-worth issues. Addressing these shadows and challenges can be supported by everything that is presented in this podcast. If you haven't already, Make yourself as physically comfortable and supported as possible. Gently closing your eyes, maybe using an eye mask or an eye pillow, and let your body feel heavy, settled, grounded. Notice the movement of your breath without needing to change anything bringing more of your attention and awareness into the physical sensations you are experiencing now. 
allowing your breath to move in like a wave, allowing your breath to move out like the wave moving out, the breath washing in and over you, the breath receding and washing away anything that you no longer need, the breath as a wave moving and filling every cell of your body, the breath as a wave moving out, clearing away every level of your body, mind, and being, the wave of your breath supporting you in feeling, sensing, and being more aware of your physical sensations, your presence in your body, and actively dialing down the activity of your mind so that your mind is connected into your heart, is connected into your body, and specifically into the sacral chakra. Settling, relaxing, releasing, becoming more and more present with each breath. For your next three exhales, actively exhale as if you are consciously pushing out anything, thoughts, feelings, sensations that you no longer need. You can release out a sigh or a sound with your breath if you wish. The breath flowing in, the breath clearing out. Ah. And now that you are feeling even more present, even more relaxed, you see, feel, sense, and know that you are descending a set of stairs, slowly moving deeper into a canyon where a river is flowing at the base of the stairs. And there are hot springs there and a beautiful, comfortable bathtub waiting for you with the perfect temperature of hot spring water ready to support your journey. You feel your body relaxing even more deeply as you continue descending the stairs. You feel yourself going deeper and deeper into a state of relaxation. Mm, The rushing river at the base of the stairs is clearing your conscious mind, is clearing any troubles you're carrying in your heart, is clearing your emotional center in your sacral chakra. As you arrive at the base of the stairs, your feet land in in the sandy bank on the edge of the creek. You walk into the cold, rushing water, which actively clears away all levels of your body, mind, and being. Then you walk to your private room with a view of the rushing river beneath you. You slide the door open and you release your robe and glide into the bathtub that has been perfectly prepared for you at the precise temperature that supports your deep relaxation. As you are settling into this bathtub with hot spring water, the river rushing below you, and the orange glow of the sunset in the canyon, you know that you are being transported both back in time and forward in time as you are actively anchored in this moment in time in your experience of this deep hot spring healing of your sacral center Each breath, your body is relaxing and surrendering into the support of the tub and the perfect temperature water to support your relaxation, healing and releasing, clearing blockages and stagnant energy from this life 
and perhaps past lives, maybe even from your lineage, the sacral chakra being cleared and activated into the great center of creative power that awaits you. As you are resting and relaxing in the tub, you can feel your guides, angels, and teachers clearing your energetic and etheric body, clearing the pain body, and opening and activating the bliss body on a profound level. Nothing to do nowhere to go except to receive the gifts of this clearing and healing of your emotional center in the sacral chakra, supporting you in becoming more clear of how to alchemize the charges that come with emotional energy. You are seeing, feeling, and understanding emotional energy on a whole new level, rather than resisting or trying to control the flow of emotional energy, you see yourself working with the flow of emotional energy as creative life force energy. Just as the river flows beneath you, you do not control the river. You do not try to stop its flow. You enjoy and understand the creative power of the river of emotional creativity that is flowing beside you, beneath you, inside you, above you, and in every interaction you are engaging in in your life. And in this moment, you are seeing glimpses as if on a screen in front of you, the greatest emotional charges that have impacted your life. And on one side of the screen, you can see how you reacted in the moment because the charge was so great that you were consumed by the energy and reacted in the way that you reacted. On the other side of the screen, you are seeing the possibility of working with the emotional flow, working with the creative charge, working with the alchemy of emotions, the alchemy of sensitivity, the understanding of emotional clairsentience, being able to tune in to the clarity and frequency of the energy, being open to the understanding that connects so deeply below and so high above into the infinite navigating from the earth to the infinite through the human experience of the emotional realm. Ah, your whole system is being cleared, aligned, activated, with profound understanding that each emotion is a frequency, each trigger is an invitation each misunderstanding, each flavor of emotion is a particular frequency to create with. And you can see how the mind's misunderstanding, you can see, feel, sense how the cultural misunderstanding of the pure power of emotions has impacted everything and everyone in your life. Yet now, now you are breathing in the pure power of emotional clarity. You are embodying the wisdom of emotions, the frequency of each emotion, not better or worse, higher or lower than anything else, but a pure, powerful experience of being human, being human. The emotional river of love, of desire, of devastation, of life and death, of heaven and hell, 
And now you are so clearly attuned to the push-pull of your programming, of your past experience that has decided what is wanted and what is unwanted, what is desirable and what is undesirable. Yet in this moment, you feel the flow of the river, the emotional, creative power of source energy that is coursing through the canyon, coursing through your veins as your blood, coursing through your mental, emotional, physical body, coursing through with great clarity your spirit, your soul, your heart. Your body, mind, being is so deeply relaxed, yet alive and awake with clarity, understanding, awakening, and activation with this greater understanding of your emotional body, of your second chakra, of the power of water, of the alchemy of emotions, and the pure creative power that is available that is an invitation, an opportunity for awakening in each moment, rather than a struggle fighting against what is. It is the pure power of creative energy. You see, feel, sense, and know it now in a way that you haven't before. And you know that you get to choose how to utilize these skills in service to yourself, your community, humanity, and the greater good. This great gift of emotional clairsentience is activated in your sacral second chakra. So clear, so powerful, so profound. Your body resting in a bathtub of beautiful, sacred, healing, hot spring waters deep from the core of the earth, the earth, the water, the fire, all present in this experience of the hot springs. The orange glow of the sunset outside is activating even more deeply the healing power of your sacral chakra. The river flowing just outside, flowing through all levels of your body, mind, and being, clearing, aligning, activating your soul purpose and soul assignment more clearly and with greater courage and compassion than ever before. Ah. And you know that you can return to this sacred space any time you need support in clearing your emotional body, your sacral chakra, to the next level of awakening. As you are resting so deeply in this healing water, rising from the core of the earth, heated from the fire of the earth, you are resting and being held in these sacred waters. You feel your gift of emotional clairsentience being clarified and distilled, knowing that you are a student of this practice, yet you feel a deeper level of mastery in understanding how to interpret the emotional information, the psychic senses you have about other people's emotions, places, and objects. You are able to release your fear because there is a deep sense of clarity in being able to interpret and understand the information you are receiving. You also know that you have the ability when you open the channel of receiving information and when you close the channel. You are designed to have healthy boundaries with your emotional clairsentience as you do with all of your embodied intuition and psychic senses. 
with emotional clairsentience, sometimes things have felt complicated in the past. Yet now your clarity is refined. Being able to know what is yours, what is information to share with another, and what is a distorted energy that simply should not be entertained on any level. You are a student and always learning, yet now you have moved to another level of embodied mastery of emotional clairsentience. You are actively practicing being in your body, rooted in the earth element and the base chakra, supported by the water element here and the sacral chakra, the fluidity and ability to navigate emotions. Just as water flows, your ability to work with emotional clairsentience always is seeking the path of least resistance. You no longer feel called to try to stop the flow, but you understand the flow and can work with the flow in a way that supports your confidence and embodied knowing understanding and activation of emotional clairsentience in a way you may not have believed possible. You know you can return to this sacred space by the river in the canyon with the orange glow of the sunset, resting in the beautiful support of this tub of sacred healing hot springs for your next level attunement. For now, you know your journey is almost complete. You rise from the healing waters and replace your robe. Your body is so clear, grounded, and filled with sparkling light that is activating your entire system all the way to the cellular and DNA level. You walk with incredible grace back to the sandy bank of the river where you place your hands and feet in the cold waters of the river and receive the activation of both the hot spring water and now the cold river water again. Being able to hold the heat, the coldness, and every level of emotional expression that is possible with ease, grace, and great love. You offer your thanks for this experience and as you are walking up the stairs returning to your physical body more completely, we will explore the self-inquiry questions and journal prompts. Describe a recent situation where you felt emotionally overwhelmed. How did this experience manifest in your body? And what insights did it provide you about your emotional sensitivity? And now, what clarity do you have about how to utilize emotional alchemy next time? In what ways does your creative expression, your daily living, art, music, writing, serve as a channel for your intuitive and emotional insights. Reflect on a time when you accurately sensed someone else's emotions without them explicitly telling you. What physical or intuitive cues did you pick up on and how did you interpret them? How has your relationship with your own emotions evolved over time? And how does that impact your ability to sense and understand the emotions of others, places, and objects? Imagine your sacral chakra as a vibrant, flowing river. What obstacles or dams might be impeding its flow and what steps could you take to restore its natural movement? And as you continue rising up the steps, you are becoming more aware of your physical body. You begin gently moving your fingers and toes, taking deeper, gentle breaths, 
and then opening your eyes and taking in the lights, the colors, the textures of the room that you are in. Thank you for being a part of the pleasure-led movement. I'm honored to support your embodied spiritual awakening. I want to extend a special invitation to our listeners. If you're craving a deeper exploration of your desires, whether they are personal or professional, consider booking a sensual hypnosis desire session by phone with me. It's a unique opportunity to explore your personal journey that supports you to delve into your dreams and purpose to clear limiting belief codes that are blocking you. To schedule your Desire Session, visit desiresession.com. Are you ready for personalized purpose coaching with me? The Embody Soul Purpose series transforms wounds from the past into wisdom and wonder in the present and the future in a soul retrieval and timeline healing process to clear, balance, and harmonize all of the seven main energy centers. Embrace all aspects of your past so you can create the greatest chapter of your life. Schedule your life-changing series at EmbodySoulPurpose.com. Leave a review and follow on your favorite podcast app. I believe in you and the magic power of your soul. I'm sending you so much love.